Someone just told me that the package is here. I don't think I've been this excited for a package in a while. Marty, what did you get? Wizard frames. First, I just wanted to go over and actually explain the setup that I'm riding here. So, I have a Salmon ST90, um, which is a little bit too flexible actually. It's definitely better than when I was riding with a V13. I got an Intuition V2 liner in here, and then I got the NR100s with the mushroom blading wheels. So, my first impressions when I first started riding was it's a weird type of rocker. I'm used to very rocker. I skate um, a wish frame with a two millimeter rocker. Like I skate 68 and 58, which is insane. <laughs> but I, I really like enjoy the swivel stuff. You know what, this is gonna be less of a rocker, but it's a different type of rocker. Like, it's it's weird. It's steady enough where I could go fast and have fun, but at the same time, it allows me to do my, like, spins. I went to what we call waterfront, where there's this little bank, and I was like, I'll just do some of these spinny things on the bank, and I was having so much fun. I was able to do everything that I was doing on the wish frames, but with the wizards. But the one thing I've noticed on the wizards is they're just so much higher quality. Not to wreck on wish frames, I love wish frames and I recommend wish frames, but the aluminum, I don't know what it is, the aluminum makes it, you don't have those little crap, like, when you have a plastic frame, you hear all the vibrations and you feel everything. The aluminum, I think, smooths it out. Not only because it's bigger wheels, I'm saying, coming from the 110 Trimax frame to this, the Trimax frame is, is plastic. So when I came to these 100s, right, the wheels are smaller, felt so much more high class and high quality. I can't do a review on the Wizards yet because I've only skated them twice. And at first, the first time I went out, I was debating to myself, is it really worth it? Like, um, when you buy it complete, it's still $400 or $500. Was it really worth of $500? So I'd say my first session, I'd said no. But then I thought about it and I kept thinking about the feeling I had under my feet. And I realized, wait a second, it's worth the premium you're paying. I just feel like this frame makes skating 10 times more fun. I kept thinking about the premium and uh, like the feeling, the smoothness, and I haven't felt that before, like in anything else I was skating. I can't get over this. Anyone who's saying the frame is long, I actually love it. Compared to the three wheels, 110s, the four 100s, I just, it, it's a lot bigger, and I love it. Like, I love the extra frame length. Not only that, the frame height doesn't bother me. I mean, I guess I got used to the Wish frames and then the Trimax frames, I think, might be as big as this. But the only thing bothering me right now isn't the Wizard frames, it's really the boot. The boot is maybe like half a centimeter or so too Whoa. big for me, so my foot moves around a little bit and it's pissing me off. First impressions are these things are awesome, okay? And I'm gonna continue skating them. Hopefully I'm gonna make a review within the, over like the next three weeks. I wanna skate them properly, get a feel for them. I wanna go and do like some street skating with them. Like go to the regular street skating spots and see what I could come up with and just be creative. If you have an opportunity to try them out, I'd try them out. If you're a blade enthusiast, I definitely recommend getting a pair. Like there's no way you could skip up on this. But then again, this isn't a view. This is just a first impression. So, yeah guys, have a good day, and I'll see you next week.